Well, hello, we're here at uh, Langara Golf Club, um, site of the 2011 Vancouver Open uh, Media Day, and we're here, we're glad to have uh, Mr. Adam Hadwin here. Thanks, Mr. Uh, great announcement uh, that the Vancouver Golf Tour is uh, putting on today that uh, Adam has decided to commit to uh, defend his title from the 2010 Vancouver Open. And Adam, we, uh, we can't say how excited we are uh, to have you here and uh, to have you back in the field uh, in this event uh, is just amazing for Vancouver. Um, you've had a dramatic rise uh, to fame um, in Canadian golf and on the PGA Tour the last uh, couple months. And we're very excited to have you. So Thanks, Chris. Appreciate um, it. Care to have, give us a few thoughts about um, about your year? It's, uh, it's been pretty <laughs> quick. And, uh, yeah. I mean, I don't really know what to say. Uh, it's, you know, it's like you said, it's been a bit, a uh, bit of a dramatic rise. Uh, it, it's all come very quickly, and it's, you know, the last seven weeks has been a, a pretty fun little seven weeks coming off the U.S. Open and and playing a couple of good tournaments, Canadian Tour, and then to do what I did at Canadian Open and and follow it up at Greenbrier. It's just, uh, it's been a bit of a whirlwind, but uh, you know, I knew it was coming. Yeah. Uh, I knew that I'd get out there and compete at some point. I just didn't know it was going to be this year, and it happened to be. Well, started uh, back a couple well, years ago in 2009. Um, you played a couple of Canadian Tour events and uh, made the cut in those. Uh, yeah. You're pretty good at that. And, uh, and then you made the decision to uh, to stay local and uh, yeah. continue your year uh, in Vancouver and play the Vancouver Golf Tour. And uh, obviously you learned a lot uh, playing with a lot of the top local professionals, Bryn Perry and Phil Jonas. For sure. A few wins, three wins, <laughs> and a tied for first in one of the Pro-Ams. Yeah. Yeah. So tell us a little bit about how that uh, how that helped your confidence. Yeah, um, like you said, I you know I I wasn't going to rush into things. Um, I knew I had a long career ahead of me, uh, and you know the the Vancouver Golf Tour just seemed like a perfect fit. I think you've done an incredible job uh, giving the the local pros something to, to play for, um, and something to play in. And uh, you know it's, it it helped me you know gain some experience with them. They've obviously been around the game for a while. Uh, you know. Phil and, Phil and Bryn are excellent players in their own right, um, and they have every, you know, they have, you know, Bryn's probably got just as good a shot as making the tour as I do. So, um, you know, to compete against them and get day-in, day-out competition against them and, and some of the other local pros, it was it was great learning experience, and I was able to take that to the Canadian Tour. Yeah. And then I've been able to take what I've learned on the Canadian Tour to, uh, to the PGA this year. So it's just kind of been a stepping stone every year, and, you know, hopefully this is my year to make the tour. Great. Well, other than the plans to uh, play in the Vancouver Open, uh, which is obviously, uh, we have to mention our sponsors, uh, Payne Edmonds, uh, Mr. Brad Garside has been one of the Vancouver Golf Tour sponsors for five years, and uh, they stepped up this year and have allowed us to, uh, to push the purse up to 50000 this year, which Beautiful. compared to what you're used to playing for, <laughs> not, not, not as much as the PGA Tour, but it would be fantastic to yeah. hand over that $10,000 winner, winner's check to you again this year. Um, so beyond the, the Vancouver Open, uh, what are your plans for the fall? Um, well, I've got, I'm heading back on Monday for two events on the Canadian Tour. We've got uh, the final two events in C4th and the Tour Championship in Windsor. Right. I'll come, uh, come back here, play the Vancouver Open, and then, uh, you know, hopefully my standing in the World Golf Rankings stands and I'm able to make the World Cup team. That uh, is uh, number one top Canadian now, right? <laughs> well, I think everyone knows yeah. that by now, right? Um, you know, if, if, if I'm able to stay up there, then... Uh, I'll be on the World Cup team, and we have a qualifier in September and, and the right. World Cup in November. Uh, Where is it being held this year? Uh, back in China. Great. China as well, the qualifiers in Venezuela. Yeah. And then, um, you know, I'm just going to do, I'm going to hang around Vancouver for September, October. Yeah. Uh, get to, get kind of my body looked at and get that ready to go for uh, 2012, and then and uh, do some nationwide Mondays as well, some PGA Tour Mondays, and hope for some sponsored exemptions. And then head to Q School and, and uh, you know, get my tour card this year. Good for you. I like how you put that. Get your card. You're exempt through the first stage. Uh, Mr. Adam Hadwin gets into second stage of the PGA Tour uh, through his making the cut at the U.S. Open, yeah. which was in dramatic fashion again. <laughs> and um, we hope to uh, have many dramatic moments at this year's 2011 Payne Edmonds Vancouver Open. Adam, thanks for being here, thanks and uh, we look forward to having you for the next uh, at the next. Uh, I just like to thank for, my uh, my major sponsor Callaway. Uh, you know, first year with them, couldn't be happier. Uh, my big supporter Belfour, they've been with me now for since the very beginning. Uh, I'd also like to thank my family, uh, all my friends for their hard support. Uh, my golf coach Brett Saunders and uh, new part of the team Scott Rogers. Uh, is, you know, I've got, I've got a great supporting cast around me and I couldn't do it without everybody. Thank you. I would obviously like to uh, pay tribute to the Vancouver Parks golf courses uh, on the rotation of the 2011 Vancouver Open this year. Uh, Fraserview, McCleary and Langara uh, are going to be a fantastic treat for the players this year. The conditions that uh, the golf course superintendents put them in the last two years that we've uh, hosted the event here 
are phenomenal and uh, we're excited to, to have it at these three courses again for the players.